Hi, my friends, and welcome to my third video. Um, oh, wait a minute. This is also my third week of CrossFit. Yes, I am sore. Yes, I hurt. But guess what? I'm already telling a difference. I can already tell a difference in my clothes. So, um, yahoo! Today, I thought we'd talk a little bit about pet peeves. And we all have pet peeves, and uh, I have uh, a list about, uh, let's see, oh yeah, 17 miles long. But today, we're, we're going to narrow it down, just talk about a few. Um, and maybe you can, can relate to a few of mine. Uh, one thing that I hate is uh, going into Walgreens. I mean, sometimes you have to pop into Walgreens and buy makeup. Uh, going into Walgreens and you get lipstick and the color that's on the end of the tube of lipstick is nothing like when you get home because you can't try it on at a place like Walgreens, obviously, and you don't want to. But you get home and the color is nothing like the color that's on the end of the, on the, end of the tube. I'm like, what the hell? I'm going to tell you, honest God, one day, this is almost embarrassing. One day, I am going to uh, show you the lipstick sack that I have. Yeah, it's like, uh, that's pretty sad. Okay, another thing that I hate, I mean I hate, is when somebody, you're driving down the street, somebody pulls out in front of you, and then they go nine miles an hour, of course, that's when I was when there's no one behind you. I mean, honestly, look at the big picture out there. I mean, seriously, look, if there's a car coming, look to see what's behind them. If there's nobody behind them, it doesn't matter if you pull out and only go eight miles an hour because there's nobody back there. Go as slow as you want. But why pull out in front of somebody and then go eight miles an hour when it doesn't have to be that way? Oh, you get it? You get what I'm saying? You know another thing I hate? Oh my God. Laundry. Laundry. Okay. My daughter's others, husband's, fiance's, boyfriends, all of the above, will will understand their um their love a little a little more if they're watching this right now. It's not that I really hate laundry. I don't mind putting it in the washing machine. I don't mind sorting it first and then putting it in the washing machine. I don't mind moving it from the washing machine to the dryer. That's where it starts to get a little dicey because uh, I hate taking it out of the dryer and folding it. I hate, hate, hate it. I, I mean, I, I mean, I hate it. I hate folding laundry. I, I, I just don't, I don't know. I don't know where that even comes from. You know what else I hate? Worse than folding and laundry. If I after if I make it to the folding part, what I hate after that is putting it away. Oh my gosh. Sometimes sometimes the laundry will stay on top of my dryer for like ever until you know finally we're gonna have company and I'm like shit, I gotta I gotta put the stuff away here on the top of the dryer. So it'll, I'll, I'll, I'll be forced, you know, to, to put it away. But, you know, another thing that this is the all-time ultimate hate thing about laundry that there is that could suck about laundry, mating socks. Oh, gosh, I hate it. I hate, hate to mate socks. I I don't mate mine. I mean, they're just like thrown in a drawer. Well, I don't really wear that much. Well, now that I'm a, like a CrossFitter, I wear like, you know, little things. But I hate mating socks. I, I just hate it. I mate, I mate, mate bird socks. I mean, and I put those away. But, and those are all dark. They suck. They suck. It sucks. Because at least they're different textures. But most, they're all dark. They're all the same color. Freaking hate it. Freaking hate it. You know another thing I hate? Oh, God, this just irritates me the crap out of me acronyms i mean acronyms R refi seriously we are so busy these days that we can't say refinance we can't say refinance i mean oh my gosh bay bay you know what bay is short for babe that doesn't even cut off a syllable i mean it's just it's just bay <laughs> i mean seriously bay hey bay Bay, oh, you are such a bay. 
it does and you know i get it because it's now you know kids nowadays or whatever i just i just bay i just don't you know another thing that i and this is just the word literally have we gotten so far away from our own credibility that now we have to throw in the word literally to make people believe the statement we're getting ready to say that tree was literally grain literally grain yeah yeah they're green you don't have to say literally oh my god the other day i was going down the street and literally a fire truck passed me it's like i just you don't have to hey sweetie you don't have to say literally uh no you know oh my god oh my god like i was sitting next to the fire the other day and it was literally hot okay well um yeah that doesn't really uh yeah that doesn't really work you know another thing i hate i just this i i hate this i hate it when you're like craving something most of the time for me it's sweets because you know of course i'm trying to cut all that out but you're craving sweets, whatever it, it is, a brownie. See, now this is making me crave. I'm now I'm like gonna, I'm gonna die for this. Maybe a hot fudge brownie sundae. Oh my gosh! But then you get it, and it's not hot, or the ice cream is not hard enough, or the fudge is kind of not good, or the brownie sucks, or it's and it's not and then you, you first of all you crave it and then you go and spend money on it which you know then you eat it and it sucks oh yeah that is uh pretty much worse you know another thing this isn't really a pet peeve i guess i don't understand twitter i don't understand it i mean really i don't even you know i have a twitter account and i guess the people have to search you out and then use those hashtag things, but I don't understand it. And what is the hashtag? I mean, is is like if I say hashtag literally, is there some is what does that even mean? Or if I say hashtag bay, what is that? I, I, I don't. Know. Does that mean that there are other that all the other hashtag bays out there are gonna come swarming in, or you're gonna be somehow connected to the other hashtag literally hashtag bays? I, I don't I don't even understand I don't understand it I mean I just don't understand how it works I mean that's you know I mean that's not really a pet peeve but I just I just don't get I don't really understand and this is okay we're sort of off the pet peeve thing now I don't understand Instagram now if you have your Instagram and then you put it so you have Instagram and it's connected to your Facebook why don't you just have Facebook I, I mean these are just things that I'm going to have to learn. I mean, it's just, you know, now that, you know, I'm really a technologically savvy YouTuber with my own channel, by the way, the Daphne Project, I changed it, um, which thanks to Stacy. Thank you. You're sweetie. Thanks to uh, Stacy, I changed it to the Daphne Project, and that's a, that's a pretty big project. Um, let me see. I have a list. I'm sorry. Pretty way long to learn this. Oh. <gasps> Oh, this is the all-time worst. All-time worst. Cell phone and computer updates. Oh! Hate them. Hate them. Hate them. Why? Why? We bought your phones. There's four gazillion of them out there. We bought them. We like them. Why do you have to update it and then change the fonts and then move the icons or change the thing? I don't even know what my, where my gallery is anymore. I mean, I don't even know. Or, or even worse, I'll have a, a laptop at home that I haven't used in a while. There'll be an emergency at work that I need to jump on my laptop because I won't be able to get it through the phone, uh, probably because the phone is updating. And I go to turn on my, my computer and it starts updating. And it's like four days worth of updates. Okay, that's that. And it's an exaggeration, but it, it's ridiculous. I mean, I just let it go. Let it go. Wait till we buy a new one or wait till we say, wait a minute. You know, we really don't like these fonts anymore. Can you maybe fix that? 
IBM or Microsoft or I don't know who even does any Windows or Samsung or AT and T. I just got an AT and T update for this phone. It sucks. I mean, it sucks. Oh, hi Maggie. Isn't she a sweetie pie? Okay, one day I'm going to tell you we're going to have to do one of these videos with my horses. I mean, it's just oh, mwah, mwah, mwah. three three kisses for my three horses. Hey, you guys, thanks for joining me today. I hope you have a great re rest of the week, and I will talk to you in a few days. Have a good one.